Good morning. Day number 88. Weather rolled through last night as I was setting up camp. Temperatures cooled down. Fog rolled in. It rained all night last night. I woke up to this uh, very misty, foggy morning. Not sure what the weather is supposed to be like today. Didn't have a signal again last night, so I couldn't check the weather, but so far it's been good. It's been a really cool morning though, hiking through these misty mountains. Very Tolkien-esque. <laughs> so many times on this trail and, and not just mornings like today, but so many times I've been hiking along and it feels like I'm in a scene right out of Lord of the Rings. So cool. And uh, so this morning has certainly been one of those days, but not sure what the plan is for the day. It all depends on weather. I know the terrain, according to the map, is looks like it's going to be pretty uh, pretty good as far as getting some good miles in if the if the weather holds out so we'll see what happens but i have no plan as far as miles go the only thing i have planned for certain is i'm gonna eat that breakfast skillet mountain house meal for dinner tonight i mentioned that yesterday that i planned on enjoying that but ended up going to that wayside and having a burger and fries but I do plan on eating that tonight. Breakfast skillet and some flour tortillas. And I'm looking forward to that. So we'll see what this day brings. We'll see what this trail throws at me. But I'm just looking forward to another great day on the AT. Another hiker said a while back that this trail is not always enjoyable, but it's always fun. And that is certainly true, and I have to remind myself of that fact often. Because it's not always enjoyable, but it is always fun. It's not always enjoyable when you're hiking in the pouring down rain like I did this morning and the wind is blowing hard. It's not always enjoyable when you're going straight up a hill, which I just didn't finish doing that. It's not always enjoyable when you slip on a wet log and land on your rear end and a group of teenagers have to help you up 
which happened about a half an hour ago. And they were kind enough to help me up because it's hard to get up. One, when you land on your butt. Two, with a heavy pack on your back. And so they were kind enough to help me up and I'm sure they were cracking up on my account later. But that wasn't always, you know, it's not always enjoyable. But it is always fun. And I know before long, I'm going to be back home and I'll be doing all the normal things, the going to dentist appointments and going to the bank or waiting in line for something or fixing something that's broken or doing laundry or any number of things that we do on a, in our lives on a regular routine. But for right now, for me, this is what I'm doing. And even on those times, in those days when it's not enjoyable, I'm gonna do my very best to have fun. To have fun out here, even when it's not enjoyable. And speaking of fun, I met a guy at the church hostel that we stayed at in uh, Waynesboro, Virginia. And he hiked the Appalachian Trail uh, several years back and, and uh, he completed it. And he was telling us, a, a group of us there, uh, when we stayed there that night, uh, this story. He said he was hiking along one day, just him. And it was just one of those days. It was a, it was an off day. It was a bad day, and he's just kind of grumbling and complaining to himself about uh, this and that, and trail conditions and and whatever you know. He was complaining about, and he said he had a conversation with himself that day, and his self asked him this question as he's walking down the trail, grumbling. His self asked him this question, are you having fun? Well, his answer to himself was, no, I'm not having fun. This day's terrible. And he went down the list of reasons why the day was terrible. So, answer no, I'm not having fun. Well, his self asked him this question next. Well, whose fault is it you're not having fun? So he said he thought about it for a moment and came back with the answer, well, it's nobody's fault but my own. And then his self said to himself, then start having fun. You might be having a rough day, maybe a rough day on the trail. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good. Thank you. You might be having a bad day on trail or a rough day on trail but figure out a way to have fun. If you're not having fun, it's nobody's fault but your own. Figure out a way to have fun, even when it's not enjoyable. That right there is a lesson for everyone, not just for those who are walking the Appalachian Trail. Made it into camp for the night. Pretty good day of hiking. 18.6 miles. Not too shabby. Stopped at another uh, wayside uh, here in the Shenandoah National Park and had a nice little snack of uh, Cool Ranch Doritos. And I finally, at long last, found another Yoohoo, the official drink of my 2023 Appalachian Trail through hike. A mess. Anyways, getting ready to eat dinner. I've been looking forward to this for a couple days now. I, I've spoken of it. It's the uh, 
uh, the Mountain House meal, breakfast skillet, shredded potatoes and scrambled eggs mixed with pork sausage, peppers, and onions. I'm going to heat this up, take a couple uh, flour tortillas, sprinkle this in there, and just uh, have some breakfast burritos uh, for dinner. And uh, looking forward to it. So that's going to do it uh, for today's video. Nothing more uh, uh, to report, really. Just a uh, rainy morning. Turned into a decent afternoon. Uh, looks like it's going to rain again uh, tonight. So I'm going to get this food in my belly. I'm going to get tucked in the uh, sleeping bag and get a good night's uh, rest tonight. I am tired. Thanks again for watching. Appreciate y'all. God bless y'all. And I'll see you back on trail tomorrow.